happy birthday america i am an american i am a muslim and a bought an american dream today is 243rd american birthday and i'm not feeling comfortable america you have been so, through so much you have been through, through so many revolutions epidemics you have been so, through so many wars inside threats and outside threats but today's threat is a little bit different and i'm feeling bad why because we are not justifying you american american are they are not justifying you they are not happy with you and that is that is a that's a very very some issue for me and i wanted to leave this message for some of my brothers those are working on certain agenda I, I, my meaning is towards the chop city the people those build the chop city in seattle which hardly last 10 days why your philosophy failed you left with two murders you were there to embrace mr floyd you were there for change but why you are not and you left with the two murders derek jones derek jones who was 19 years old day before yesterday there were two shootings and my question to to you is this you know how old were they 14 and 16 my question today is to the Jenny Duncans, who was the mayor of Seattle, who gave this block party a summer love. And what happened there? Drugs were used openly, rapes happened, murders happened. This is your philosophy? Now you're taking this philosophy to New York. I'm here since so long. I have seen New York before Mayor Giuliani. I have seen the peep shops, sex shops in Manhattan. I have seen the junk cars all over the New York. I have seen New York burning before Giuliani. I have seen New York, which was worse than Afghanistan and Syria. You want to do that? This is what the America George Washington left. You wanted to burn George Washington statue? Have you tried to educate yourself what, what was Ibrahim Lincoln? Why he was killed? And you want to you wanna destroy his legacy? His statues? There is no justification for that. I know you are bored. I know the last eight years, every state legalizing marijuana, which, which is a gateway to drugs, which is a gateway to addiction. I know the, what kind of songs you were playing at the Chop City. I know what happened there. That's what you want America to be? A black country? A party country? A socialist country? Imagine if the people run away with the money from this country. Who's going to pay for the entitlements? Today, everybody look up to America. Because reason, you're the best country. America is the heaven on the planet. And I'm a testimony of it. I buy an American dream. And I'm a proud American. My request to you is please, violence is never a solution of everything. Hatred is enough, enough is enough. My request to you is, if you want to, if you are, if, if think the slavery bothers you, my first thing, my first request to you is, take N word, F word and B word out of your songs. And please, stop trying to follow these rappers. You know where the rap music came from? From the cotton fields of slaves, where the slaves were picking cotton. And today, that doesn't bother you. But the statues, the people, the heroes, those built this country. I wanted to take you a little bit back. You know how many people lost their lives? 6,000 people lost their lives during the first revolution in 1776. 20,000, they were held prisoners during the civil war against slavery, 360,000 people from North, they gave their lives against slavery. And today you are playing with them? You, are, you, are, you wanted to dishonor their, their legacy by destroying, burning this country? You are against American flag? You are against American anthem? Why don't you stop, uh, you know, why don't you stop using cotton then? If that reminds you slavery, why stop using sugar then? Because 
the entire world was a sugar cane plantation and that's where the slavery started from. Why don't you boycott sugar then? This is not, you can say, you can change history. If I'm a Muslim, September 11th shook up my life. And if, if I'm in love with this country, you can be too at the same time. I am a good father. I am a good American. I love this country more than my life. And I request you, I beg you, today is the 4th of July. Let's get together again and promise to make America safe again, strong again. And let's live in harmony and peace again. If a Muslim American can request you this, and if I'm not facing racism, you are not facing racism at all. The only thing is bothering you is because your economy is strong, you have enough money, and you are bored. Go listen to music. Go play chess. Go play sports. Please stop burning America. 170 federal, American, federal buildings in Washington, D.C., they were vandalized. For what? What you gained out of it? When you burn police cars, what do you think is going to help the racism? No, it's going to increase racism. Please, as a Muslim, as, a, as a, an American, listen to this music and let's start working together again. Regardless you are socialist, regardless you are Democrat, regardless you are Republican, regardless you are Antifa, regardless whose life matter, let's start loving us each other again. God bless America, God bless Americans, and God save everybody from Corona. Thank you. Thank you.